One of the state's oldest theaters prepares for a new two-person show. Joining us on the CI stage, Red Mask Players of Danville. And the two people who are in the show conveniently are here with me, Jim Gilmore and Nancy Henderson. Welcome. Thank you. Thank Thanks you. for being here. Let's uh, talk a little bit about the theater to start. Uh, one of the oldest in the state, but dating back to the 30s, yes? Yes, 1936. This, we just finished our 82nd year. Wow. Continuous. Uh, and it's all, it's a, a volunteer theater organization. Community. And, and so what does that mean year by year? What uh, types of productions, how many, how does that work? Well, uh, for a long time, we've been doing, and we currently do three uh, adult productions or, you know, what we call main stage productions a year. And we do ch two children's productions that are entirely um, children sure. uh, performing and uh, performing for, well, the general public. And in the spring, we do a uh, children's performance for uh, we invite the uh, school children in Vermilion County to come and... And so this is the stereotypical community theater. So people from the area who are coming in right. and doing it, not professional actors from right. the outside. Right, right, right. Now, Jim, uh, you're one of the actors here. Uh, talk about the gin game and uh, what, what this performance is, is all about and what, uh, what it looks like. Well, the gin game's a pretty popular show. It was uh, on Broadway in the mid-70s, 76, Hugh Cronum and Jessica Tandy did it, and I think they were nominated and or won Tony's Jessica for Jessica won a Tony for her performance, and it won the 1978 Pulitzer Prize. It's Pulitzer about, <laughs> it's about uh, a nursing home, and we are residents of a nursing home, and we meet as she's a brand new resident, my character had been there a couple of months, and we meet, and my character likes to play gin. He thinks he's a very good gin player, and he talks to her about it, and they begin to play gin together. And that progresses throughout the entire show. They're, they're playing together. They, they reveal a lot of other things about their lives. And it's, uh, so it's not an hour and a half of a gin rummy or anything? No. <laughs> no. We no. do play uh, quite a few. But there's, but there's a, there's a side to it. It gets a little darker as time okay. goes on. It's, it's, uh, it's tragic comedy but it's more in the beginning it's funny it's cute it's you know it's the typical old age thing and then it gets a little more concerned interesting yeah. well you've left some uh well, stuff I, on the table there that we I, don't know I which have is great. to say what our this is how our director described it it's timely and timeless with something to tell us about aging and ageism, politics and class, and friendship and love. Oh, that's not bad at all. That's a good description. <laughs> yeah. did, did you know or do you have to know how to play gin uh, going into this, or is it all fake? <laughs> um, do we want to answer that? Oh, maybe I don't <laughs> okay. give anything away, so if I'm going too far with it. Actually, so. when I first found out I was going to do this, I did actually play gin. Yeah. Okay, so we play gin. Unfortunately, we can't dictate what the cards are going to be, oh, but we right. do play gin. Okay. I mean, we, we, we deal, we do it, and we play actually gin. So if you were watching it and were a gin player, you knew You would we know were, you were really yeah. doing mm -hmm. it. Mm -hmm. What are the, uh, the dates of the, the performance? The dates are Friday, June 28th, Saturday, June 29th, and Sunday, June 30th. It, this is a fundraiser for Red Mass. And so Friday is a dessert performance. Okay. We'll have dessert and wine at the theater. That's at 6.30. And Saturday is a dinner. Now, we don't have a, a kitchen or anything at the theater, but there is a very nice restaurant right across from our theater called Vips Restaurant, Perfect. and they are opening especially in the evening that evening to serve uh, serve us dinner, and then you just walk across the street oh, and come and have dessert and wine at the theater, and see the show. And then on Sunday it's just a performance. Got it. Well, we will get you all the details about the performances on our Facebook page, and we're going to see a part of the performance coming up a little later on here on CI Living.